Your file shows no kills. But to become a double O, it takes two. When Daniel Craig got the call that he would be the next 007, he was shopping at a Whole Foods supermarket in Baltimore on break from shooting Invasion. Craig made an immediate beeline to the liquor aisle and had his own private martini party. In Casino Royale, Daniel's Bond is just beginning his spy gig with the British Secret Service, and his first mission is to infiltrate a high-stakes poker game that is a front for terrorist funding. Daniel talks about being directed by Martin Campbell in the film's poker scene. His energy is just infectious, and you need that energy because the fight sequences are very energetic. Uh, but you also need it in, small, in, in quieter scenes, like the, the stuff we're filming at the moment, which is the casino. Um, because it's very complicated stuff and we're filming from lots of different angles and filming a, a poker game, which I didn't know before, but I do now, is very complicated and very laborious, over $70 million in front of us. And, you know, it's, I know it's not real, but it's, it's still, you can generate some excitement very easily about it. What's a Bond film without the villain? In Casino Royale, the international money launderer funding terrorist organizations is played by Meds Mikkelsen, famous in his own native Denmark. Meds says Daniel Craig is shaking and stirring up his own Bond. Bond is different. He's, um, he's a more whole person. He's got, he's got skeletons in the closet as well, and he's got weaknesses, uh, and uh, not only the women this time, but personal weaknesses and uh, so I think it's it's a must uh, he has to con he has to concentrate on the acting in this film because it's it's a very strong thriller and story not only a Bond film but it's also very th a very strong story this Bond doesn't love him and leave him either with a strong love story between him and Vesper Lind played by Ava Green the treasurer hired to supervise his access to millions of dollars at the poker game what she doesn't gamble on is falling for Bond. Ava talks about connecting with Daniel Craig from the first screen test. He's just, you know, not big-headed at all and um, very human and, and as an actor he's just so strong and intense, you know, has amazing blue eyes and he's just very, um, he has like an animal energy and very centered, which I think is quite new for Bond. You know, it's, it's quite scary and dangerous, but also um, very attractive. Daniel Craig has signed on for at least two more Bond films. Casino Royale opens Friday in theaters.